Hello, my little Willy. In today's tutorial, you will learn how to knit this gorgeous lace column stitch. It's great for knitting scarves. This is the other side of the work, so although it's not reversible, I love the look of these lace columns. It's really easy to do, just two rows that will be repeated time after time. The steps are pretty simple, so it doesn't matter if you're just a beginner, and I'm going to teach you how to do it in both English and Continental style. And when I was doing this swatch, I forgot to add the same edge on the other side. So now that I know how to do it, I will give you the proper instructions. And you can find this pattern on my website sewwoolly.net. There is a link for you below this video on the description box. So I hope you like it. Grab your needles, a little bit of yarn, and let's get started. First of all, we need to cast on multiples of five. For example, five times two, ten, plus two, twelve, plus 2 salvage stitches. So I'm going to cast on 14 stitches. So, first row, first and every other row, right side of the work. We will start with knit one, because the edge stitches, the first and the last, will be knitted on each row. And now comes the repeat, what you will find between asterisks on the written instructions. Yarn round the needle. It's not doubles, just to bring the yarn in front of the work, now purl two together, and knit three. One, two, three. This is it. Let's do it again. Yarn round the needle. It's the yarn over when you're going to purl next. Purl two together. Careful not to split the yarn. Bring the yarn to the back and now knit three. One, two, three. If you have more stitches, keep repeating until there are only three stitches left. Ending with yarn, round the needle, purl two together, and knit one. But only on this first row, I like to work it through the back loop, so you don't get a huge loop there. Okay? Second and every even row. Knit one, the edge stitch, and now comes the repeat. Yarn over, just bring the yarn to the front. Knit two together. Keep the yarn over there in the middle. And now pull three. You can see the three bumps there. One, two, three. And repeat. Yarn over. Bring the yarn to the front. Knit two stitches together. Be careful and always be sure that you are taking the two of them. And now purl three. One, two, three. 
If you have more stitches, keep repeating until there are three stitches left. Ending with yarn over or yarn forward, knit two together, and knit the last one, the edge stitch. So these two rows form the pattern. Now, if you need continental style, that means that you keep the yarn always on your left hand. First and every odd row, we start with knit one, and now comes the repeat. Yarn round the needle, keep it in front of the work, purl two together, knit three. One, two, three, and repeat. Yarn round the needle, bring it to the front, purl two together, knit three. One, two, three. If you have more stitches, keep repeating until there are three stitches left. Ending with yarn round the needle, pull two together, knit one, the edge stitch. Okay, second and every even row, knit one, the edge stitch, and now comes the repeat. Yarn over, knit two together, pull three. And repeat, yarn over, Knit two together, pull three, and keep repeating until there are only three stitches left, ending with yarn over, knit two together. So these two rows create the pattern. Repeat them until the desired length is reached. Now if you want to add this bottom edge that I have made in garter stitch, just knit two plain rows before rows one and two. Okay? And when finished, knit three rows in garter stitch this will be the first, now second one, and the third one, knitting every stitch, and bind off knitwise after the row three, so facing the wrong side of the work. If you don't want to add this edge, just bind off knitwise after a row two. And that's everything for today, my little woolly. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. Thank you so much for your messages and comments, and thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel and happy knitting!